Hey YouTube, Generators2000 here with a uh, airport update of San Jose. I still don't have my airport board yet, uh, the new one I'm going to build, but hopefully I'll be getting that soon. Uh, right now this is just on the floor of the kind of where it would be and stuff, so. Um, so just, uh, I haven't done like an airport update in like a month, so I wanted to do something, so. Just got blocks and stuff kind of put together, uh, San Jose, so. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, San Jose is a pretty simple airport. It's just like a, a long line and this is the exact same like terminal shape You have terminal a to about right there terminal B over there There's 28 gates and I have all 28 of them all the airplanes are in the correct spots where they park And if they aren't then I'll say something about that and all the routes are real and I'm pretty much got all the aircraft they fly on except for like a like a couple flights and stuff so uh, yeah, it should be uh, pretty realistic in terms of routes and aircraft and just the terminal design and stuff. So, I'll we'll just start out over here in Terminal A. First uh, sets of gates is Gate A, like 1, 2, and 3, and 4, 5, 6, and then it just goes like that. Um, right here is uh, American Eagle E-170 heading to Los Angeles. Uh, American kind of parks in this area right here, but uh, since they have like uh, ran out of gates in their area right there. Like the last time I was in San Jose back in the summer, the American Eagle E-170 is right there, so I put them right there. Gate 2 is empty. 3 is a gate which uh, Hawaiian uses. They use 3 and 15. Um, so right here is a Hawaiian 767 in from Kahului. Now he's heading to Honolulu. There's no time period. Just uh, all the planes that go here. Right here is a Delta Connection E-170, which is flying to Las Vegas, and it came in from Seattle. The uh, Delta Connection also serves Los Angeles. And Delta kind of goes in this section of gates right here. And so that's gate 4. Gate 5 is Delta MD-90 heading to Minneapolis, St. Paul. Uh, gate 6 is uh, A320 heading to Salt Lake City. And gate 7 is a 717 heading to Los Angeles. I took that flight. Uh, it was a flight 1936. Sorry about that, to Los Angeles. And yeah, and I'll assemble this up. Right here is a JetBlue A320 heading to, uh, it came in from Long Beach and is gonna be heading out to Boston. And they parked kind of around gate eight. And then I think maybe sometimes in this area, like gate, gate over there, but mostly gate eight. And right here is the American 737-800. These are gates uh, nine, 10, uh, and 11. That's where American mostly parks. Uh, he's heading out to O'Hare, and right there is a 737-800 heading to Dallas-Fort Worth. There's an A320, uh, which is heading out to Phoenix. Phoenix is mostly A320s, because there's like four A320s, and and then like one or two A319s, so got the A320 in. Air Canada parks here. It's an Air Canada CRJ-705, which is going to be heading out to Vancouver. And right here is a United A319 heading to um, Denver. And that's pretty much what they use. They use A319s and E170s on Denver. And so United, they see they use one gate right here, gate 13. And they use the Houston flight on that gate. That flight's taxing right now. Polaris, uh, like I've, like this is gate 14. It's not really an international gate, but the international gates are right here and stuff. But I have him right here just because I think I saw on Google Earth one right here. So he's in from Guadalajara. He's heading back there. Sorry about that noise in the background. And just moving on to A15. Wine uses this gate in the morning because there's no other like heavies here. There's a British Airways 787-9 heading to London Heathrow. And this is my first uh, time this is an airport update. Air China A330-200. He's heading up to Shanghai. That's gate 16. I think starting at gate 16 or 17 is where B concourse starts. Like it doesn't start out, it's like B1. It's just like, it just continues on the gate numbers. So you have gate 17 right there, but it doesn't fit because they have a wide body there. So it's converted. Then you have the Lufthansa A340-600. Uh, the real route is a A340-300 operated by a city line, but I don't have that. So that's what this is in here for. And it is heading out to Brentford. I'll get the planes that are just taking off right here. Just taking off the runway, which would be 30 right, WA320 heading out to New York JFK. And just pulled off of 
three zero left and just holding short, three zero right is the ANA, triple sum 200 ER, they use 787-8. Um, he's in from Tokyo Narita. And yeah, so just get the other plane taxing the United uh, uh, 737-900 ER, which is heading out to Houston, Intercontinental, and United is gonna be starting service to O'Hare and Newark um, in March, like March 9th. Newark will be on a 737-800, and O'Hare will be on an A319 and 737-900. Uh, back over here, we have a Southwest 737-300, which is going to be heading out to Las Vegas, and it came in from Los Angeles. Right here is a 737-700 in from Seattle, and it's going to be heading out to Austin. Right here is a 737-800 pushing back. It is pushing back for Denver, and it came in from Dallas Love. Right here is a... CRJ-700, which is going to be heading out to um, uh, Burbank, and it came in from Santa Ana. Right there's a Sun 37-800. Okay, on this side, better view. Sorry about the shakiness. Uh, Sun 37-800, Heart 1. I flew on Heart 1 on my last trip. You can see it in the trip report. Hopefully you watched that. If you haven't, you can go check it out. Uh, Heart 1 is heading to Baltimore, and it came in from San Diego. And then right here is Triple Crown 1, first time this guy's in the airport update. Uh, very nice model. And this is gate 20, um, I think 23, I think. 23, that's the end of the southwest gates. And then Terminal B turns into Alaska. And it is heading out to Portland, and it came in from Ontario. Starting gate 24, or 25, I think, actually. Yeah, you have 20, you have to say 25, 26, 27, 28, because I know 28 is the last gate. So yeah, it's 25. Gate 25 is a Alaska 737-900ER, which is going to be heading to, um, he's also heading to Portland, and it came in from Cabo. Uh, Portland's on a 900ER, but Cabo is sometimes on a like an 800 and 700. Right here is the 737-800 Spirit of the Islands, which came in from... Uh, it just came in from Lahui and is going to be heading out to Honolulu in the morning. Here's another 737-900. This one came in from Seattle and is going to be heading out to Guadalajara. Those are both 900 routes. Right here is a uh, Q400 and the uh, little tail wing is kind of broken off. This plane is kind of kind of not, not the best condition, like the front nose gear is missing and stuff. So I wish this model, model was better. I just need the glue on that tail wing. I just need to find some glue. Um, it is a Q400 operated by Horizon heading to Reno and it came in from Eugene and Horizon also serves um, Boise and Salt Lake City. And you have Alaska operated by SkyWest, which uh, if I had one, it would have came in from uh, Orange County and departed to San Diego. And then they also serve Portland and Burbank is beginning in March. And then the uh, second to last plane, just sitting over here in remote parking, Alaska, 737-800. Uh, which uh, is in from Kahului, and it's going to be heading to Kona in the morning. So, uh, and that's all the routes that Alaska does. They're just starting up in Newark on March 12th on a 737-800. So that's pretty much all that stuff. You can see Concourse B is pretty new. Uh, they have the check-in area for right here, and it goes from, it's like gates like 17 or 18 to 28, so it's around 10 gates. You have internationals like these four right here. And then over here is Terminal A, as you can see right there, and the check-in for Terminal A would be right there. So, the final two planes, actually. This plane, um, Norwegian does not go to San Jose, but I have this plane operating for Hanan Airlines, because they do 787 service, and they're kind of a red livery, so I decided to use this one. Hanan, they use 787-8s, and if I had Hanan 787-8, it would be going to Beijing. And then the final plane... A Delta 737-800 on uh, final approach for runway 30 left, and it is coming in from Atlanta. So it'll go over parking the A gates, A7 or something like that. So yeah, that's the end of this video. Uh, I hope you liked it. I'll try to do a tail shot again because, like this airport, it's a pretty simple design, but they have really cool, just cool tail shots and stuff. So, uh, yeah.
like that's a nice tail shot right there. I'll just end it like that. I uh, hope you liked the video, and I'll hopefully be doing more of these airports at like other airports. If you want to see another airport, you can comment below, and if I have all the planes for it, we have a lot of Deltas, Alaskas, I have like six Southwest, so if you want to see uh, that airport up here, uh, you can comment below. So uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and thank you for watching, and see you next time.